Divers are combing the compartments for more survivors amid strong winds and downpour. More than 4,600 people, including divers, police, firefighters, and Chinese Navy soldiers, are involved in the rescue mission. Some volunteers also joined the rescue work. We heard that a big cruise ship has sunk in the Yangtze River Monday night. We rushed to help with the rescue efforts Tuesday morning. Chinese President Xi Jinping has dispatched a state council work team to the site to guide the search and rescue work. Premier Li Keqiang arrived at the scene on Tuesday. He asked the rescuers to seize every second, battle fatigue and challenge extremes. According to China's Central Meteorological Station, most of the Yangtze will be subject to downpours for the next 10 days, with heavy rain expected where the search is underway. One of the survivors is a 65-year-old woman. The 65-year-old woman was rescued by divers who brought an extra breathing apparatus up into the bows of the ship and spent about five minutes teaching her how to use it before bringing her out to safety.